Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big Porky here, the voice of hardcore boxing. Women's boxing, where is it heading? Uh, I don't know. I think the big stars from women bo women's boxing are the ones who've been in the Olympic teams, you know, the top notch fighters, but how can they get matched correctly? I mean, Savannah Marshall's fighting somebody 44 year old for world title. That's just going to be a knockout, isn't it? She's a massive favourite and I'm, I'm praying she wins, but I know she will. It's political correctness that's got women's boxing going on it, basically. That's why they've had to get behind it, the TV companies and that, but how many fights have we seen apart from Pursoon against Katie Taylor, where Pursoon won comfortably for me, but she got robbed, but how many fights have we seen in women's boxing where we've said, Do you know what, that were a good fight, that. That's the only one I've seen. I haven't seen another fight. I have not seen one other fight that's, that's had me on the edge of my seat. Not one, so I don't know where it's going. I look at, uh, I'm not going to, I'm not going to, hammer it too much because they're getting a living aren't they and, and they're putting the effort in but Shannon Courtney's in a division where there's two people in her weight division in Britain the Boxing Board of Control don't put a British license so, sorry don't put a British title out there to British license holders that are, that are female there isn't a British title so you can be in a world title fight after five six seven eight fights that's where we're at so how can you learn your craft as a professional having a world title after you've had a handful of fights? You can't, can you? But there's not the people there. There's not the fighters there for them to be for it to be competitive. Uh, so it's easy to nick a world title. That's how I look at it. It's easy to nick a world title. You can spin a narrative on social media and get everybody eating out the palm of your hand if you sell yourself correctly, but all I'm interested in is the boxing. I want to see a good fights. So I don't want to see two minute rounds because if you get a runner in a two minute round, she's going she's gonna to run two minutes, isn't she? Anyway, in a three minute round. In a two minute round, she's still going to run two minutes. She might engage for 20 seconds, spread over the two minutes. It's not fan friendly, the stinkers. Women's boxing stinks. Nobody's going to say that, are they? But it's stinking, isn't it? Savannah Marshall spars men. She can take big shots off men. She can hand out big shots. She punches harder than some middleweight men, some welterweight men. She punches really hard. So how are they going to match Savannah? They're not going to, are they? The only fight for Savannah is Clarissa Shields. These other fights, they don't interest me. But I want to see her win a world title, but it's a poison chalice, isn't it? So that's just my opinion. I wish everybody who was a woman who fights in boxing game all the best, but I just want to see 50-50 fights now. That's what I want to see. I don't want to see knockovers where you've got people who've been training at the high-tech facilities up here and being Olympics and world championships fighting chefs or dinner ladies. I don't want to see that. It stinks arena out and nobody dares say anything because your cluster's... I don't know, a hater or whatever, but I'm going to say something on that situation. We've got to have 50-50 fights, and that's what we've got to have for it to move forward. Otherwise, I can't get behind it. Not for two minutes. The training for three-minute rounds, so two-minute rounds is easy. Get them in at three minutes and get them in with fighters that are their equal. That's the only way we can grow it. We don't want to see knockovers. It's no good. Or people backpedalling. I don't want to see that. Alright, peace out. Don't have nightmares.